it's very interesting in some of his early works, especially in Carnaval, every time there's a, a piece finishes, there's either an F or a E sign at the bottom of the double bar for Eusebius or Florestan. Yeah, then of course he takes it to Carnaval and then he spells it out completely for you. He gives you Eusebius, a whole piece of one minute of extreme calmness, extreme beauty. And then it's suddenly followed by Florestan, which is just a rampage of things happening. It's havoc. It really is havoc. And then suddenly it finishes. The same way it came, it goes again. So this dichotomy of Eusebius and Florestan is present in everyone, but especially in Schumann it was taken up to extreme. Perhaps we should be grateful to him for showing us the, the way of not behaving all the time, but um, there's a time for Eusebius and sometimes there's and should be time for Florestan. As much as there's a lot of work into this music, it's so much fun to play, so much fun to listen, so exciting. It's, for me, it's been a trip. It, it really is a trip. It's a trip through life, through the eyes of someone else. So I just would be happy if everyone enjoys the same trip as I have. And I've had the privilege to be the guide of it. <laughs>